Well, good evening, everybody. I'm Steve Montelli. Let me show you what came in the mail today. This is a real, real cool little thing. This is a just a small card wallet from Dave Mitchell at uh, Mitchell Leather. And you can see his logo stamped right in the front of it. But what makes this so unique is that this is bison leather. I didn't even know they made leather out of a bison. But this is a Chromexel bison leather from a tannery right in Milwaukee. This is not from Horween. This is from La Tannery in Milwaukee. Very, very cool little thing. Um, and he just made it up for me and sent it out. And he said, hey, I know you like things that are very thin. And this is very thin. I have preloaded it with my stuff. But as you can see, Dave's usual fine craftsmanship is evident in this leather. He always does a great job with the... Uh, with the uh, leather uh, products he works on, the inside, the inside is a is a Horween Dublin, so it's got a smooth interior. And the Dublin, as I've seen on Dublins before, is very thin. I don't know if you can appreciate that with the dark leather, but the Dublin is very thin. So I've put five cards in it, and I have put two uh, basically business cards on this side and two bills folded only once now Dave said he uh, likes to fold the bills he quarters the bills to put them in there but uh, you know I, I really just can't do that Dave sorry but uh, I did fold it only once and I only need about a quarter inch more to get it to close completely properly but what I do is I take it and I hold the bills down and then I sort of roll the cards over the bills and it fits just fine just fine so that's how thick it is with five cards and uh, two business cards and two bills folded once. Very cool little piece of leather here. Uh, bison leather. Look at look at the um, look at the grain on this thing. Look at how big the grain is on it. And he sent me and he sent me a piece of just a plain piece of the bison leather. Let me show you this. Now this, as you can see, is more of a burgundy color, but this stuff. When I feel it, when I feel it in my hands, I mean, it almost feels damp. And, and he said in his email that this, that this bison leather is filled with lots of oils and emollients and waxes like the Horween Chromexel, but not from Horween, from uh, Law Tannery in Milwaukee. But this stuff actually feels damp, and, and it's really fun to play with. And he said it was going to be fun to play with, and it is. What you can really see on this is the pull-up effect of the leather. Let me, let me see if I can, let me see if you can see this. If I fold it real tight like that, you see how it gets all light right in there? That's the pull-up effect on the leather. And then when I let it go, it's like magic, and it just kind of goes back into the leather. But, but, but look at how thick this is. And obviously, I believe it's been dyed a burgundy color. But look how thick that is. That is really a very, a very... I don't know, robust piece of leather, I guess we'll call it. But this is the suede side. Um, you know, and, and there's nothing rubs off on the hands or anything like that. But it's really, it's really a great leather just to, just to go like that with. I mean, you can see the pull-up on it. Here, let me do that. Look at the pull-up on that. See? I mean, every place I squeeze has got the pull-up effect on it. Then if you pull it out like that, the pull-up, just goes away slowly but the pull-up goes away very very nice piece of leather I mean really you got you know what I wish I could reach through the camera and let you feel this because it truly feels damp I mean it feels I, I, I don't know if you can hear that or not but it truly feels like you know you just took it in the shower with you anyway thanks Dave for uh, sending both of these out this is a very very cool little wallet I'm gonna enjoy playing with this and I mean this is he said this was a very very small and thin wallet and and it is I mean this is what I've been carrying in my other wallets and you know that I change the wallets about once a day anyway but this actually sometimes twice a day don't let me uh, misstate that once a day you know the uh, the uh, illness is ongoing with the wallets anyway so very cool wallet thanks dave bison leather who knew i didn't know but uh you know five cards two bills two business cards 
Horween uh, Dublin on the interior, very thin Dublin. And somehow this piece of outside leather is much thinner than this piece of just raw bison leather. But this is definitely a man's leather, let me tell you. Anyway, you guys have a good night. I, I really enjoyed presenting this stuff. I'll talk to you later.